Hey, good morning, Coffee Nation. All you Folgers out there are here for the new Folger Black Silk review. Um, you know, why Folgers this week? Have I done Folgers in the past? Yeah, yeah, I have, Coffee Nation. But this time, they're trying to rebrand it with their new, hey, meet us again, Folgers. We're not just Grandma's Coffee. My grandma doesn't drink Folgers, she drinks Maxwell House. Roast Master Series, great for hot or iced. Black Silk, as dark as it gets. And select line of exceptional coffee brands, carefully crafted by your experience of Roast Master's Folger Black Silk. Now, not to mention Coffee Nation, uh, the price of Folger has definitely gone up. I think this can cost me like eight bucks. I was like, holy crap. You know, pretty soon the cost of coffee is going to outweigh the cost of YouTube. So you might not be getting very many of these reviews. No, no, I'm kidding. Just a joke. All right. Well, let us uh, sample it and see. And like always, I did brew it with purified water and a little pinch of salt to perk up any of those bitter tastes. But, I mean, offhand, I'm not getting a whole lot of bitterness, though it is a dark roast. You know, it's not burnt. And it's a fresh brew. It's not, um, I think it would be a good dessert coffee. Dark roasts having, you know, less caffeine than the lighter roast because it cooks off. And then on top of that, a nice good bitterness to this. Other than that, you know, you got a little bit of that kind of charcoal flavor, but not like bitter, not like bad. It's sedimentary to the, um, you know, the roast of the coffee, which is, um, you know, almost non-apparent. You know, you just got that charcoal. Granted, it's still hot, so I maybe need some time for it to mellow. But we will see. Anyway, I see this being a good coffee for like a donut, a banana bread, you know, sweeter things. Coffee cake. Because that's where it truly shines. On its own, it's kind of like, you know, not bad, but also kind of like nothing really great, you know? But urge you overall to try this one definitely three out of five Folgers black silk because it does live up to its name it's a very dark coffee and it's smooth but it's not like anything magical it doesn't dance it doesn't have like multiple flavors or anything like that just kind of one note oh but yeah, not bad, uh, not disappointed, uh, and overall, because how can you be, it's Folgers, alright all you Folgers out there, you stay coffee.